Yeah, it's practically high noon here in Vixiopolis. How you doing, everyone? Yeah. Good girl. Good boy. Good whatever you are. How are the... The foxes doing? Seem to be alright. Most of them are sleeping under the tree. I actually do kind of want to change out... Where'd the bird go? Oh, it's on my shoulder. Uh, why is the bird on my shoulder? I'm pretty sure that I told you to sit. I don't want to have to deal with your dumb butt. Anyways, greetings and welcome to Minecraft. As I also like to call it, Mincraft. Uh, I should probably give you a little bit of a tour as to what happened since the last time that we recorded. Also, wait, what? We'll get that in a minute. So, first off, after uh, having a bit of an issue with the door frame on the gates on both sides, I decided to reset them, replace them. Not like actually replace them. Like, you know, I swapped a new item out. I put the doors in a different spot. And they actually uh, swing out the way that I want them to. You crazy little furry bandits need to get away from the door. Yes, you. Knock your nonsense off. Yeah, one of my wolves is uh, crying because it's injured. And uh, I believe it's this one with the gray collar. Yeah, because the tail's kind of down now. Although it wasn't down before. That doesn't matter. We're still working on... Calm down, girl. Still working on, uh... Breeding the animals that we need. Although... We have a lot of chicken. And with that note... Yes, I have, in fact... Expanded the chicken coop. And I actually opened it up a little bit. Make it a little bit more, more airy. Make it nice. And, uh... Holy frick, look at all the... I don't know how I got your eggs, but I got your eggs. There are so many eggs in there. I basically have an endless supply of them now. Like, there's just way too many frickin' chickens. I fixed their doorway, so... Now it's not just this little notch in the corner. Oh my gosh. So many eggs. I just got a full stack. And they're still popping off. I think there's like four of them. Yeah, the <laughs> there's a bunch of them just mesh into one in this one corner. I don't know why they're stuck in this corner. That's uh odd. But anyways. Moving on. So yeah, the the Jack and Coop. Is much bigger now. It looks much nicer. The door frames for the the vixens has been fixed in some capacity. And my idea actually was to tear down or chop down, whichever way you want to look at it, the trees that they have in there. Cause I figured, you know, I want a nicer set of trees for them to sleep under. And of course. The nicer trees would be the uh, the cherry blossom trees that I have hiding in one of my, uh, my treasure chests. I have still not made my house because, you know, priorities. And I have expanded out and made a little bit of a ranch here for all of the meat. Also, uh, we have Billy there. Billy's a goat. He's just there. He's just Billy. But as you can see, I have a ceiling going. But unfortunately, it is not complete. Especially since uh, I kind of need it. Because Billy likes to jump a lot. 
Billy is a hyper child. Now I need a little bit more wood to be able to finish this off. And the reason that I'm doing this. Billy, we're going to have problems if you keep doing that. I didn't think that you would actually slam into the bacon. But that was super rude of you. I swear, if you do it again, your butt's going to be back out in the snow where you belong. Do not tempt the bacon again. Do not hit the bacon. You better be sorry. So, yeah. Whoop. There he goes. So yeah, the reason why I'm putting the roof up here is because, you know, being that... This is snowy territory, and I don't want to, uh, to deal with having to pick up the snow within their area because for whatever reason, the pigs and chap are actually smart. Yeah, you're smart for once. Yeah, not smart enough. But I better go uh, sleep now before mobs start spawning in. Alright, when the snow falls, it obviously layers over the blocks. And when it layers over the blocks, like this, it creates a little stepping stone. And even one snow block, or like a snow slab, gives them the ability to walk over the fence. And I hate that. I don't like that they're smart enough to understand that they can just walk over the fence. So... My gosh. I put uh, the basic maple tree saplings here. I was not expecting one to grow like that. That might actually take a while to chop down. But I need this specific wood for the ceiling when it comes to Sure, I have another axe. Yeah, I do. When it comes to the cattle pen, uh, this is gonna be a bit of a problem. Okay, what I intend to do. Basically for this session is I'm going to chop down all the trees that are inside the uh, the fox pen after I get the roof of the cattle pen situated. And then we're going to plant new trees in there. We're also probably extend it out a little bit since uh, I believe we got the dark wood for the fencing. If not, I can just plant more darkwood trees. Oh man, I have a sneeze coming in. Hate it. Now, of course, when I announce it, it decides to vanish. Like, nope. I'm out, bro. Which is very annoying. Oh my gosh, this thing way over complicated itself into existence how the frick am i gonna deal with this oh as a dangerous height Gotta knock out as much of this as I can. Only because I need to find out where the actual stumps or uh, the trunks, the branches of the trees, end. Knowing that if any one piece of the tree, piece of wood is still alive, and I thank you for the apple, it will, uh, Continue to stay here and be an eyesore. 
and I don't like that. I myself am already an eyesore. I don't need another one. Wait, what? Now, I still intend on doing a mining run to actually... Okay, Billy's gotta go. I just heard him picking a fight with the bacon. We can't allow that. The only person who can pick fight with bacon is me. Alright, that should be all of the branches. Yeah, that should be everything. So, the rest of the tree will fade on its own. Oh my gosh, look at all the seeds that they dropped. Yeah, I definitely got back what I put down. Alright, Billy, you're a problem. I was kind of hoping that you wouldn't be a problem. But, uh, ow. Frick you, berry bush. Yeah, I was kind of hoping you wouldn't be a problem, but you decided to be dumb and thus be that problem. Uh, I think what I want to do... Since Billy's gonna be relocated. More or less rehabilitated. Ah, you know what? Put Billy over here. There you go, Billy. You think about what you did. You're in timeout now. Probably forever in timeout. There you go. Some light to shine on your stupid. Now, now that we've taken care of the problem, child. Uh, we need to... Put this down. That should be more than enough. I actually calculated to need, like, probably three stacks. But I'm gonna try to just go with two. And as far as I've calculated, these should be set up unless they've changed the game since last time that I played. Like last time before I actually started the series. Uh, I have the slabs set up to where nothing should spawn on top of them. So I shouldn't need torches to light it up. Frick. All right, we did not need three stacks. All right, everything is good. We can now unleash the meat. Hmm. Actually sounds weird, don't take that out of context. Get out of the way, I'm trying to unleash the meat. Frickin' uh, I thought you were supposed to be smart. There we go. Apparently you're as dumb as bricks. 
Out of the way. There you go. Yeah, they're free range cattle now, technically. They can roam to a certain extent. How you doing over there, Billy? Ah, yeah, Billy's fine. So now... Oh. No, I don't want you to come through the doorway. It is now time to breed. Let's see what happens when the black sheep and the red sheep breed. Hi, how you doing? They made a black sheep. I was kind of hoping it would be a mixture of something. Maybe they would become maroon. Yeah, hello, pig. All right, bacon. Make more bacon. I don't have enough carrot for you, but let's see if we can make you grow up. Grow up, dang it. Yeah, he grew up. There you go. Kind of bacon. Everything's good. It's nightfall already. The tree is basically gone. Hey, right, good night, Billy. We're almost there, gang. I have bread, the bacon, and the steak. And some lamb chops. Yeah. We're gonna have a lot of food. But I still don't understand why you wouldn't accept the chicken. Like, seriously. We got so much of it. Like, to the point where I might actually have to get rid of some of them. Like, right now. They just dropped so many eggs. It's ridiculous. Like every time I come in here, I at least get one full stack of eggs. And weirdly enough, a full stack is... 16. I don't know why it's set to 16, like... Yeah, that's usually what you get at a real store. This is Minecraft. There's no such thing as a store. Stores don't exist. I mean, yeah, you could technically buy from villagers, but they don't have a storefront. And we'll deal with the chicken city. I really do want to help my wolves, though. They kind of need it. So at that point, it's time for YouTube to look away. Alright, now that we've, uh, taken care of the population, we're going to force some more of them to spawn. Of course, you know, I had to get unlucky there. Oh, sorry. Sorry. There we go, there's another. I wish I could actually rapidly fire onto the jackets. Stop. Okay, that one, though, is your fault. I'm trying to get out of your way. You stepped in my way. Bad. Yeah, I want to rapid fire, but if I do that, I might end up actually harming some of them. I don't know how much damage they actually take. All right. Well, those tiny ones will grow up eventually. I don't think I got as many back as I, uh, as I disappeared, but, ah, yeah, whatever. It'll be enough. All right. Oh, you interested in the raw chicken? What if I cooked it? 
I think it'd be better if I cooked it for you. That way you don't get salmonella. You know what that is? It's poison. Well, at least for us anyways. I don't know what it is exactly. All I know is that it is not healthy. Alright. Here, eat cooked chicken. Cooked chicken is good for you. There you go. And then... up, oh, Make babies. Yeah, more wolves for the pack. Where are you going? Sit down. Where are you going, Chad? Get over here. There you go. Sit. Not sure what kind of collar color we should give you. But it definitely ain't going to be red, that's for sure. What, you want light blue? I think I have light blue, actually. I do not. But I do have blue. We can try to make light blue. Let's see what happens. I don't really need that, but I'm going to use it. It'll make light gray dye. Oh. I don't think that's going to work. I need a different flower. Maybe Lily of the Valley? Lily's having fun over there. Yeah, that'll make white dye. Aha! There we go. Light blue dye. Perfect. There you go. Yeah, now you're pretty. Alright, frick. Uh, hold up. This is raw chicken. I don't want to give you raw chicken. No. Raw chicken is bad for you. Where do you think you're going? Come on now. Ugh, why does cooking take forever? I want my food instantaneous. Hydrate to level 4, please. There's a Back to the Future reference. Alright, sit. All of you. What color do you want? You want purple? You're not getting pink like your mom. You want black? You want white? Well, you nodded your head, which makes me think that you might want black. Yeah, he want black. Alright. I have one. Well, I have five black dye, but I don't have very many black dye. There you go. Black collar for you. Yeah, fancy. Elegant. Exotic, even. Where'd that other bird go? Frick, it got on my shoulder again? Really? Trying to figure out what the button is to... to see this dumb... Any, any of those? There it is. Apparently it's my directional up button. Why is this idiot still on my shoulder? 
I told you that you need to sit. Stay there. All right. You all have fun now. And I ask that you uh, kind of move away a little bit from the fire pit. Pretty sure. You. Make sure that those parrots aren't being stupid. Like, seriously. Grab a couple more axes. Uh, I don't really need wood anymore. Well, at least not that wood. So let's drop that in here. Along with that. Yeah, we got tons of dark oak log. So, first things first. I want to knock out the trees. I know they're having fun and a good night's sleep underneath them, but the trees gotta go. Frick, it's almost nighttime. I also need to just shovel out the snow that's in here because that's getting kind of be a pain. But I'm not going to put a roof over their heads because I actually kind of like the idea of them having snow in their den. Makes it look, uh, makes it a little bit more natural. Why are you all huddled over here? That's strange. Now, of course, you're going to start eating all of the tree saplings. I need to go get me some berries. Just so that way I can have you all control yourselves. Just kind of ran into the bush. All right, you dumbs need to not be eating the random tree seeds that I got going on here. Probably already swallowed it, all things considered. Nope, there it is. There you go. Yummy berries. Yeah, frick. What? Yes, you have a berry. Good for you. Now there goes my shovel. Frick, I need another one. Ugh. If only my tools were just indestructible. And I have no backups. Uh, I'm gonna need four of those. Two of those. There you go. I 
gotta get rid of all the snow. I mean, I would tell you not to eat the snow, but I think snow was not going to be a problem for you. Snow, frick. Do not be poisonous. Hopefully you won't take my block. You took my block! No! Give me my block. Okay, I got it. Unbelievable. The one thing I told you not to do when you did it anyways. As you know. That's apparently just how they are. Right, that's just a lot of snow. And I hate it. But, I got to, uh... Well, I can't really get rid of those because they're sleeping on it. Gotta make sure their pen is clean. Dang it, I did it again. Get it later. Yeah, can't spam it because uh, that's just gonna happen indefinitely. Yeah, good for you. You got the white ball. As long as I can grab it before they grab it. Here, have some more berries. That's one shovel down. I was about to get that one, and then one of the uh, one of the red foxes pushed the white fox that was already sleeping over it, and now I can't do anything about it. I guess that means we just gotta go knock out the tree. So adorable under the tree. I really do need to expand the pen. There's way too many of them. And there's just not enough room. Gotta get rid of all this friggin' snow. So much of it. Why is it gotta be here? Why did I have to do the dumb thing of picking a snowy biome to live in? So many snow blocks. I mean, I could use them for decoration in some capacity, but... Uh, I'm actually not 100% sure... On what and where. Maybe on my house? When I eventually get around to making one? I can put it all around my house. I need sticks. Need 
Need a ton of those. There you go. Let's make four shovels and two more axes just in case. Put the rest of the sticks in here. I am going to throw the chicken in here. I don't really need those. I got plenty of them. It'll be fine. This area is actually looking really nice now. Oh, getting dark. Got a few more seconds. Let's get one more row. Frick, I did not mean to do that. fix it. It's weird how easy it is to fix. I wonder why there's no way to revert it. Like, naturally. With the shovel. You have to put a block over it. Go ahead and, uh... Bring this up. Yeah, the reasons, I guess. Make that look a little nicer around the pen. I could make me an igloo. Hmm. That's a strange thought. How's everyone doing here? Uh, looks like everyone kind of grew up, huh? Ow. Let's go about... Reading some more. Yeah, sorry, I didn't have any more carrots. There you go. Seriously, what is the point of having the red sheep if the black sheep is just going to have a dominant genome to basically only breed black sheep into the universe? I was kind of hoping that they would mix and match. Or, you know, give me red and black sheep. Like, black sheep is nice, but I want more color variations. I want all the styles of the rainbows. I want the tasty Skittles. Trademark copyrighted, not sponsored. Also, where did I get an egg? How did I get an egg? I guess while I was next to the pen, I got one. Here, have your egg back. It didn't become anything. Disappointed. Of course you somehow snagged a frickin' snowball out of that. Little furry bandit. Here. 
All right. I think I will go ahead and extend the pen out to here. I'm not going to go for... Well, no, I kind of want it to be symmetrical. I'm going to say I'm not going to go for the extra block here and have there only be one block, but... Nah. You got to do it. Okay. Now, I'm going to put that there. Just so I have something to help me with the... Uh, making the wood that I don't have. Of course. Alright. How's everyone doing over here? Well, one of you grew up. I can tell. You, why haven't you grown up yet? Oh. Is that the reason? Okay. Get all the snow put away. Don't need the feathers. Dark wood. Let's grab all the dark wood. We're gonna need it. And also grab some of the sticks because uh, we definitely gonna need that too. We need darkwood blocks. Just trying to make a stack of the stuff. That should be good. Okay. Uh, uh, there you go. Uh, nope, not quite. Uh, there you go. Oop. Why do they sound like they're purring when they sleep? Some very strange fixins. Well, apparently, I can't. Just stand on the third block up and place these down as I go along. Kind of annoying. What? That's a little far. I'm definitely gonna need more than 12. I need more. I'm gonna take the spruce log. I have no idea what the frick's going on here. Okay, spruce log. Uh, I can make 60 out of that. Well, I need to make a lot of uh, sticks. Making sure that's not going to take up any of my dark wood. Get a stack of that. And then a stack of dark wood. Uh, another stack of dark wood. There we go. That is a lot of dark oak fans. Oh, no, it's snowing! That means all of my work to clean this place up. It's all about to go down the drain. It's just gonna get covered. All over again. 
Actually, now I think about it. Hmm. Nah. I was thinking of having one fence extend out so that way I could put a torch on it, but nah. Not gonna happen. The other problem that I have with snow falling is that I can't tell what time it is. So mobs could spawn at any moment now. I wouldn't be able to do anything about it. All because I'm like one gold ingot away from actually making a clock. And that's kind of where I need to start going into actually mining. That way I can, uh, I can get up here. Nope. Ah, it's not high enough. There you go. I want to put torches on these things. Ow. That was rude of me. Why'd I hurt myself like that? Dang it. Ugh. Now I'm stuck out here. Now let's go ahead and put a torch right there. Yeah. I need a gold ingot to be able to make a clock. Uh... Billy appears to be missing. I'm not sure why. Hmm. A little skeptical about that. I feel like it's dark out. Like, actually dark. But I should probably go to bed. Yeah. Don't want any more mobs to spawn. I wonder how my neighbors are doing. Ah, there he is. Yeah, well, as long as he's doing okay, we're okay. Reckon A, I got to clean the whole place yet again. Oh well. Like, all it would take to make that clock is just. Four ingots and some redstone. Actually, I haven't found the redstone. Well, oh, I haven't actually found anything. All of the, uh... The minerals that I got going are just from either trying to get the dirt or attempting to make that tunnel that kind of, uh... became a failed project. And unfortunately, I just was not able to get it to extend as far as I wanted to. In a short amount of time. So unfortunately... It's just gonna be there, like that, forever. Until I can get back around to it. I am... Out. Darkwood fence. Yet again. I need... More of that. More of this. And that. There you go. I 
There you go. The extension is complete. I still need to put some, uh... Actually, no, we're just gonna put that here. Still need to put some torches on top of the fence. Ah, frick. I need another black. Yeah. You see me making extension to your home, don't you? Like, wow. We're getting a foyer now. We did it ain't a foyer. Just another bathroom. Wait, what? There we go. Now, hopefully I can knock out this fence without them stealing it. Yeah, one of them's creeping around here. I see you. What do you think I'm doing? No, give me my torch. This is mine. I'll get those blocks later. I probably should think about putting in another door. Yeah, maybe later. But for now, the most important thing is getting this pen open. Do not steal my fence. Get your dumb butts out of here. Go sleep under the tree. Seriously, what's wrong with you all? Some of you still have snowballs for some reason. Why haven't you eaten your berries? I saw that. Oh no, that's a spruce sapling. Yeah. Give me that spruce sapling. Yep. Where are you getting these saplings? No, now that I think about it, I know where they got it. After I knocked out the tree. Oh my gosh, look at that pile of snow that he appeared here. That's probably all from the tree. Like, I can understand you all having the snowballs, but not having... Oh, almost hit the fox. But not... I right, give me that brat! Alright. I'm gonna need more berries in order to control them. Okay, now I'm actually starting to question where you're getting these saplings, because... I've snagged like five of them from all of you. It's getting ridiculous. Ah, someone finally grew up. You emo brat. Ah, well anyways. Let's put the spruce away. The other one. Grab the cherry saplings because we're going to need them. Oh. I have some. What's that weird noise? Hmm. 
No. Ah, they realized that the pen had been expanded. So smart. But yet, at the same time, they're so dumb. I say is I can't get through the front door. Hey, you! Give me that back! I don't know how you managed to steal a fence from me. But okay. You better not be stealing my stuff. Now you can steal the snowball. That's perfectly fine. Oh. Kinda... Running long here on this recording. Yeah. Whoop. It's almost night time again. Frick, I have so much to do now. In terms of, uh... Getting the pen ready. Ha Seriously, where do you keep getting these saplings? Get back here. Like the tree is dead and gone at this point. How do you keep just coming up with more saplings to steal from me? Doesn't make any sense. Well, I still need to knock out the spruce tree. So I want to do that first. And then set up the cherry blossom trees. I want to give them the good stuff. Oh, excuse me. The fox farm deserves all the love respect having the good stuff that's a pretty tall tree I might need to do more than just go one block up no no we're good all right sorry ladies and gentlemen you're uh I guess your blanket fort I guess you can call it. Gonna have to be torn down. But don't worry. We got more of them on the way. Let's put one... Uh, I kind of want to put them in the center. I don't want them to either not grow or to have there be a problem going up against the, the fences. So we'll put one there. We'll put one kind of want it where this hole is you better not have yoinked to that no i got it oh one there do one right there not really counting the spaces i'm just kind of guesstimating One right here, maybe? Yeah, one right there will be good. And then one... I'm gonna say right here. Can you get out the way, please? Thank you. And then we definitely need to move the snow out from around it. Just in case. I don't want it to not grow simply because, oh, there's too many other blocks in the way. Frick. I 
Hand over the sapling. You little furry bandit. There you go. Doink. They're still trying to sleep under the tree. Normal. They're sleeping with the cherries in their mouths. That... That doesn't make any sense. Get all this large amount of snow out of here. Okay, well that tree's almost gone. Gotta clear the area out a little bit. Frick, I did not mean to do that. Get out the way! Move. Can you not be in direct line of fire? Thank you. Okay. Good thing I got backups. Alright, the trees should be good. You got a stick? No, you can't have that. That is illegal. Snow and berries. That's all you all get. I need more foxes. You, make babies. Normal. I gotta clean this whole thing out again. Hate that so much. No, get out the way. There's an abundance of uh torches. Only because I wanted to be absolutely sure that no mobs would spawn in here. But I think I got a pretty good amount of them along the fence. That one's a little unnecessary, but we'll leave it. So this should be safe. I am gonna get this other one. I would like to see the trees grow, but it might take a little bit more time. And fortunately, we've already been going for quite a while in this session, in this recording. But I definitely need to work on Cleaning out the snow. I want to do one last check though, just to see how well the uh, the other pens have been doing. Yeah, no snow. Ow! 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 Okay. Had to be absolutely sure that my slab idea still kind of works. Alright. 
Look at all that snow. Absolutely ridiculous. But I think at that point, we can go ahead and say that'll be the end of today's session. I am going to go make sure that we breed a few more of uh, the meat. Got some carrot and some wheat. There we go. A random path for the berry bushes. Yeah, come here, bacon. There we go. I don't remember there being that many of you. Hmm. Oh my gosh. They're freaking swarming me. I'm having problems. You make babies. Right. Wait, did you even? Ah, they finally made a red one. Yeah, I finally got the shiny Pokemon. Where's the other shot? There you go. Oh, bebes. Yeah, my face now. All right. That'll be. Boy, what are you doing in there? You know exactly what has to be done now that you have trespassed into my territory. Get out of here. Oh my gosh, no. This is. Ugh. Great. Now I gotta go get me some more berries. Because they're gonna be stuck in there. I might actually have to move that door. So that might actually be the only door that has to be adjusted. And of course, it's nighttime. So many problems. And I don't have the bird on me. It's gonna be absolutely sure. Get away from the door. Okay. Well, at least they're not in the doorway anymore. You. We have problems. I don't want your llamas in here. You've heard me. Yeah. I don't want your llamas in here. What do you have for... Uh, if I give you emerald, you'll give me... Black ink, apparently. So that's trash. I can get black ink anywhere, anytime I want. So yeah. That'll be the end of today's session. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Stay safe. Take care. We'll see you in the next session. It's time for the llamas to go.